hello guys hey, welcome back to the channel once again this is building new tv and uh, hey thank you very much for always uh coming back to watch my videos and i've seen all your likes and your comments in this episode i'll be talking about michael Essen, former chelsea and uh, also real madrid and black stars player i'll be talking about him he's uh there are some comment he has made about ex players or ex footballers okay you know for the past weeks i've been talking about michael Essen, michael Essen, michael Essen, because hey there's a saying said there uh, before in the end, I'm, uh, who are passed, so Michael Essen is well uh, in the news, so we have to talk about him and uh, we have to express our mind. There, uh, Charlie Income viewers out there, so don't forget that you subscribe to the channel, you hit the notification bell, share this very video to your friends who like, and also you comment, do well to like the video, comment, share to your friends. Now, let me talk about what Michael Essen have said about ex players or ex footballers okay you no know, former black stars midfielder michael asian has disclosed that having a successful playing career is no guarantee of success in the dugout okay so according to the former chelsea star who acquired the uefa a and a uefa late youth coaching lances in february 2023 uh, there is a misconception that ex footballers become better coaches. So you know the that thing is that, like if you have played football before, so you are a former footballer, so you should be able to uh, coach a team. You should be able to become successful as a footballer. But my class and having different idea and different thought about that, saying that not a successful footballer can become a successful coach. Okay, so the forty year old explained that there are ex players who never be. Uh, became accomplished coaches, accomplished coaches, hence his decision to take his time to get more experience before taking any major role. So, so this is what he said. People think that because you have uh, been a professional player at the highest level, it is easy to get into coaching, but it is totally different. That is why I have managed to take my time and to take it day by day. Uh huh. He's saying he's, he's, he's talking or he's saying the truth. Okay. So it doesn't mean you have you you, you were a successful footballer. You play UEFA Champions League. You play in World Cup. You play Premier League. So it doesn't matter. So you've done all these things. So when you become a coach, then boom, you start with flying colors and you become a better coach. He says no, no, that is not the case okay so that is why he himself has yeah, taken his time doing it step by step so that he will become a better coach when he take a major role okay so asian received an invitation from fc nordland uh that is a owner tom venon to join the team's backroom staff after retiring in 2020 at nordland asian began his coaching Career. So, you know, FC Nordland, uh owner is Tom Venom. He is the same person who owns Right to Dream Academy uh, in Ghana that produced the likes of Kudus Mohamed, uh, Mohamed Salisu, Kamal Din Suleimana, a host of good and talented players who are helping Ghana to progress and also Ernest Nyama. Okay, so he's the one who I invited my listen to join FC Nordland, okay, in Denmark so that they can learn more and become. Uh, better coach after he retired from his uh, international career in 2020. Okay, so uh, ACN believes uh, with time, more African stars will venture into coaching after retiring from the sport to share their experience with the next generation. Okay, I said, I think it is just a matter of time before you start seeing our generation of footballers becoming top level coaches that's in europe and also uh, across africa so that's what he told dwtv okay is he going to say that if you are smart enough and you have passion for the game and uh you still want to do something in and around sports opportunities will come yes yeah, so the, the, the matter is being smart so what is here in this 21st century not uh hard working but smart and you push a little bit uh with hard working and uh, there you move and you become the successful coach you want to become in near uh, future. So that's what Michael Asian Bision uh, is saying that guys say hey, you need to push, you need to do your best, you need to uh, work hard so that 
you'll be able to uh, know where you want to be. But if you want to be part of football or sports, the opportunities uh, will come as far as you are smart. So this is what Michael is saying. He's saying, he's saying that not because you are ex-footballer, you, be, you can become a good coach. It's, it's not like that. It's not every footballer who can become a good coach. Michael Lesson is talking. This is very news Let me know what you think about what he said. Subscribe to the channel. Hit notification bell. Share the video to your friends. Like and also comment. Let's meet and talk more. Bye-bye for now.